The definition of feng shui is a system of laws considered to govern spatial arrangement and orientation in relation to the flow of energy. Or in other words, hmm, I think I might put my bed there. No, you can't. What? Feng shui says you can't. Feng what? Feng shui says you can't. I can't sleep in my room. It's not shuang fei or whatever it's called. <laughs> feng shui. Feng shui. Feng shui. Feng shui. Feng shui. Feng Fungus. Fungus. The fungus among us. Josh, to prove that you are a citizen again. Okay, yeah. I'm not giving you the thing I was going to give you now. Oh, come on, please. I, I promise I I'll be an outstanding citizen. Chest plate with Prot 4 on it. you got to watch the feng shui guy on YouTube. No, no, no I, I don't need a feng shui guide. I need Ashen. Ashen's my feng shui. Well, I get all my feng shui knowledge from the feng shui guy on YouTube. Feng just... shui might just be how you feel about things. Like, in real life, I would never sleep looking towards a staircase. That's just- I that do. Feels wrong. Yeah, because it's not feng shui. <laughs> feng shui. You never do like that. Uh, I can literally- I don't know. Josh, fill in that creeper hole. I, I will. See that. You're watching me from a tower. I must go to my bed. Yeah, if you don't actually sleep in your real bed, it's not feng shui. Such feng shui rules. <laughs> feng shui rules. Okay. Yeah, because it's like a set of rules how to like control the energy flowing through your bed. Josh, you haven't even like made your bedroom feng shui yet. How are you playing Minecraft with your anti feng shui? Maybe it is feng shui. No, Wait, no, no. Zero up. windows. Hang there's on. There's no energy coming in. Man. Oh, yeah. Let, let me observe. Oh, see, this is the problem. The window's behind the bed. No, it's not behind the bed. There's no window behind the bed. And the traffic and the energy on these stairs might cause distraction during sleep. Yeah, the energy's sloping down. It's gonna, it's whooshing around like my character's walking. It's whooshing around at you. I'm gonna add a pillar in my room. So I can be perfectly functional. Actually, pillars are not feng shui because they disrupt the flow of energy. Yes, they do, they do, that's right. Look at the back wall, look, I finished this. Why right. did I just say that? I'm giving up too much negative energy, it's not feng shui. I need to do a cleansing of the house. I need to light it first. Okay, it's lit. Right. Cleansing the house with this feng shui weed of some sort. Weed? No, it's not <laughs> weed, it's sage. It's sage, totally sage. Wait, I need to cleanse you. Hey. <sighs> don't don't cleanse me, please. Are you angry? You asked me to heavy cleanse I'm very calm. I'm very yeah, calm. He's been stealing, which gives off <laughs> anti feng shui energy. He's running away. He's obviously possessed. Yeah, he's obviously like, possessed by it. Do not cleanse me. <laughs> oh, that's what a demon would say. That's what a demon would say. <laughs> Oh, it's what, that's what an anti fun try demon would say. That's what the green baby would say, huh? That's what the green baby would say. <laughs> oh. Okay, I think he's cleansed enough. I need to get on with cleansing the house. <laughs> Symmetrical about that, mate. You little mouth. Thomas, is that anti fun oh, Shut up, you milk. Shut up, you milk. And anti fun try. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to. Bless you. So bless it. He's possessed by an anti feng shui spirit, boys. <laughs> let me let me make him feng shui again. I can hear the demon game release. It's working. It's working. <laughs> oh, there it goes. I think I saw it come through the TV. Are you feng shui a... <laughs> yeah. He said he's feng shui again. Yeah. Could you hear the like demon screaming? Yeah, I can hear, yeah, the, I can hear the demon <laughs> screaming. <laughs> Jack, I made my window feng shui. It was a necessary process, necessary process. Necessary to make him feng shui. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a creeper. Creepers done. explode stuff. Negative energy. Negative no, energy. No. It's... Don't be confused at confused.com. Wow, wow, Exactly. That's actually anti-feng shui, Adam. I have to bless you now. So is the door. No. No, <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I am feng shui. Okay, it's feng shui. Okay. I'm gonna make my room the most anti feng shui you've ever seen in your life. Oh, I said he's. Oh, no, he might. He's got a demon in him. He needs to be exercised. He's got. Don't return to this house until you <laughs> pray with the monks of feng shui. 
knock, 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 knock. What do you want? Um, I would like to know the location of the monks of Feng Shui. So basically, if you go into that house down there, go down the stairs, there's a monk of Feng Shui who lives inside that village house. Where's the Feng Shui monk? It's actually at the house currently. Uh, well, the Feng Shui, the feng shui monk uh, tells you to go, go to the Th Thank you, wise monk. You're welcome, bro. You're welcome, bro. Imagine if monks actually spoke like that. Yeah, G. Just, just pray for a bit, man. To become feng shui, you must go and collect slime. Deal with these anti-feng shuiers, Josh, and you shall. You, your sword will be feng shui. Go to sleep so you can be feng shui. Oh my god, for feng shui. You can receive the, the, the sun's energy in the morning. <laughs> yeah, the sun's energy. Feel the sun. Not fair. I can feel the feng shui.